Hi, my name is Dennis and I would like to present you today the new features of WhatsApp Companion. WhatsApp Companion is a plugin developed by our company Arsena to improve the monitoring of WhatsApp Goal, adding more than 20 active monitors and 6 performance monitors. This video will show you uh, standard applications monitoring and we will see the SFTP monitor, file parser monitor and the mailer monitor extended. The first one is the SFTP monitor extended. This one allows you to check an SFTP server and uh, try different commands as ls, put, you will see. So, uh, we go in the active monitor library and we're going to create a new active monitor uh, with the type SFTP monitor. Okay. In this monitor, we just specify the name, so my new SFTP monitor. Then we put the username that we're going to use to connect to this SFTP server. Then we're going to select during between this command. So we're going to just run ls and it will be the monitor will be down uh, if the command uh, we see in the result. A file called install.txt okay so we test it at the moment on the server there is no file install.txt so we're gonna just add one file on the sftp server okay and now we're gonna rerun the test because the file is now on the sftp server and now you can see that the written code is one, so meaning that the monitor is down because the file is in the folder. Okay. So we're gonna just uh, apply. So we just delete this mon this file in the in the folder, and now. If we apply this monitor on our device, which is the SFTP server, okay, SF, my new SFTP monitor, yeah, then next, okay, validate, finish, so now it's green, it's fine. We have also a nice active monitor, which is the file parser. This one allows you to parse a file, uh, new lines, wall file, uh, and looking for any information. So in this example, we're going to check the, the word error in a file. Uh, this file is, for example, uh, a log and is store, stored on a, uh, on a share. Okay. On the folder shared and in this file there is uh, many times uh, the word error when there is a login problem so we're gonna you create this active monitor uh, the type is file parser monitor and we put a name on it my new parser monitor and we just need to specify the, the folder. So it will be here, uh, UNC path, okay? So we need a user, Windows user password to access this, uh, this folder. And then we, s we put the, the file name, which is this one. Okay. So we enter this file name and the pattern. So we want to try the word error in this file and check. We can check regular expression or literal string. We have choice. The monitor is done if the pattern occurs greater or equal one time. Okay. So if we found one word error, then it's good. You can parse whole file, new line, or only the last 10 lines, for example. Okay. So we're just going to parse only new line in the file 
So, okay, we're gonna test it on it. So, you can see that the number of error occurs 1210 times in the file the, at the first check. So the written code is 1, meaning that it's down. Okay? It's very important because it means that we found the word error and the first at the first check. If we do a second check, you see that there is the, the, the monitor is up because there is no more uh, new error because we are checking new lines in the file. The last monitor that we want to try is the mailer monitor. This monitor allows you to, to parse a uh, mailbox. Okay. So we're going to create an active monitor in the active monitor library. The type would be mailer monitor extended. So we specify the name of this monitor, my new uh, mailer monitor. And then, oh, sorry. And then we're going to uh, put the connection parameters. So we're going to use a, a test uh, mail, mail for test on Gmail. Okay. We can connect on this server uh, by on POP3 or SSL, so POP3 secure. And we want that the monitor is down if uh, we found the email coming from uh, the same address and the subject contains tests and one email only. You have also some options like delete emails with field options, with field conditions, sorry, and no new email arrives within uh, the period uh, that you want. Okay. So we validate this monitor and we're going to test it on the pop.gmail.com. Okay. So the written code is zero because there is no message found with this uh, subject and with this uh, with this address mail address. So we're gonna send one on the on the mailbox just to test. So we send one mail, put the object test, and we send it. So now we have one new mail in the mailbox. Okay. So let's check with the monitor now. So we have one message found in the box. So the written code is one. Okay. So it's working fine for this monitor. And now we have still one message found. So you see each time it's going to check, there is still one message found. So if we edit this monitor and we check the delete emails with field conditions and that we test now this monitor, the first check, we're going to see one message, of course, because there is one message. But now if we do a second one, the, the email would have been uh, erased in the, in the mailbox. So we have the written code zero and no more mails. Thank you for your attention and uh, I hope this video helped you to, to use it. Uh, don't forget to contact us by email or phone or just visit our website to know more about WhatsApp company. Thank you. Bye-bye.